Hey guys, welcome back to La Passion Boutique and today we're going to do something a little different and it's going to be called November um, Favorite and I'm just going to talk about beauty products, shoes and even um, um, clothes that I've gotten in last over the last month that I really really like. So um, the first one is this um, tinted, mo tinted moisturizer by, by Laura Mercier. I think that's how it's pronounced but I'm not sure. But um, if you've been following me on my blog, you would know I really like um, really fast makeup and a lot of times I just um, use this tinted moisturizer and I'm off to work. I put on my lip gloss and that's all I do. I really like this moisturizer because it is oil free and a lot of you know I have really oily skin, my nose, my cheekbones and my forehead as maybe you can even see right now. So. Um, it's a tinted moisturizer, it's oil free and it also has SPF 20 so it's really really nice and I just want something, I just want to have you know just a little touch on my skin to hide the little blemishes and even the pimples and acne that I have so I use the walnut and I love this product it's retailing for I think $43 so it's not, it's not bad at all so before I use this, so I've been using this since last year, so it technically it's not a November favorite, but um, I just thought I should share it with you. Then I got this um, Laura Mer uh, Mercier uh, mattifying finish, and it just I noticed that when I started using it, it um, reduces the amount of oiliness I have. Typically, I um, within four hours of using you know the make or make makeup, my face gets really oily. But I noticed with this, it keeps the oiliness to a minimum. So I really like it, and it's the it's um it's a secret finish mattifying cream, and it's also by Laura Mercier. This one is I believe twenty seven dollars. So to finish off my look for work, so I use just these two products, and then for my lips, I use a lip balm, and then I leave, use this. Um, Victoria's Secret um, Minty Shine Lip Gloss um, just you know just to give my lips a little bit of glow and funny thing um, I have really dry lips so it cracks a lot and when I was younger I always had the lip gloss going um, going to school and I would tell my sister I'm looking for my lip gloss I'm looking for my lip gloss and they're like uh it's lip gloss I'm like I don't care I'm looking for my lip gloss so it's really funny they still call me lip gloss um, sometimes so when I come back from work um, I uh, most times I just wash off my I use the makeup remover and then I wash off my face using this Adovia natural sulfur soap and um, the first couple times I used it it was a little bit drying but I noticed that the um, amount of acne um, that I had um, reduced significantly so it was really nothing fancy about the soap it looks um, like this yellow so I just have it um, my, my vanity area and I use it to wash my face after I'm done I'm using the makeup remover to remove the makeup and then because it's a little bit drying I use this uh, moisturizing day cream I know it says day cream but I use it at night so I just take a little bit of it and then I rub it um, all over my face before I go to bed so we're done with um, beauty product and we're gonna talk about shoes I know a lot of you know I love my high heels but sometimes at work I um I stand about um, four hours a day and then I sit for about four hours a day so standing in high heels um, throughout running up and down may not be very practical so sometimes I go with my pair of flats so I got this one from forever 21 and it's like this little jellies I know it's winter time so what I just do is I put it in a shoe bag and I put it in my purse and then when I get to work take off my boots and I have this ready to go and this one is called Dreamed by Melissa for Forever 21. Melissa has great, great shoes because on Fridays we have denim Friday or casual Friday. So I really wanted like a denim pair of shoes. So I got this pair of flats and I got it off of ideal.com. And I live in Alaska, so sometimes shipping could be a little bit of a hassle. 
So um, whenever I get like free shipping, I always, you know, grab the opportunity to buy whatever I want. So I got this for um, $10. Next up is this pair of shoes. You've already seen me wear on my blog. I have it in gold and my twin sister has this color. And I wanted a pair of pink shoes and I really like the way this one is kind of like two-tone metallic, you know, finish. So I like the cut and I like this little lip thing over here. And since I already have it before, I knew it was comfortable. So I got this, it's um, Report Signature, but it's sold out everywhere. But I was able to get it off of eBay for how much was it like $40 and it was retailing for like a hundred dollars or so last but not the least is this pair of bow pumps from Just Fab so I've been seeing a ton of bloggers wear um, a semen up here by Amina um, Jillio I'm not sure but those those ones sell for about is it 195 to 250 but I wasn't ready to spend that kind of money so when I saw this pair come on um, Just Fab, like I did not even think twice. And I've actually won this, I wore this one in Vegas and it was a showstopper and everyone kept asking me, Hey, lovely shoes, where did you get them from? Or, um, those are really, these are really interesting pair of shoes, I like them. So, um, that's what it looks like. Now we're done with shoes, I'm just gonna talk about um, clothes and other things that I have, okay? I know you've seen me wear this wristwatch on repeat on my blog. I've had my eyes on this wristwatch for a couple, maybe three years now. So HSN um, had this um, Manhattan um, wristwatch and it's like $150. Well, before I could get it, it sold out. But my twin sister was able to get it. And um, when I saw it come back in stock, I noticed, I remember that she had not you know, won this wristwatch for a while. So I called her up and I was like, hey, Tweenie, um, I know you haven't won that wristwatch. Would you be nice and let me have it? So she sent it over to me. Next up is this um, jacket that I got off of ASOS and it's really lovely. It's, I like the um, padded finish over here. I also took this one to Vegas and people were literally stopping me and asking me where I got this from. So, um, I like it. So while I was also at Vegas, I stopped at um, H&M and I was able to get this um, Alexander Wang um, jumper and it's a really interesting piece. You kind of feel like maybe you're like a Michelin guy, you know, the bubble guy, but at the same time it's really warm and really comfortable and um, that's what the back looks like as well. So another recent favorite is this um, blazer from um, OSAP and um, I like the like colors on here it gives you that kind of candy feel and um, goes around the back as well and it's really fitted I've also worn this on my blog and it's it's a nice piece to, you know to add to your collection if you're looking to add more colors last piece of item I have today is this um, what, what would I call it like faux four um, dress and when I got it also from um, OSAP, but the thing with this dress is I got it in an extra small, but I felt like I was wearing a man's t-shirt in a size extra large. So I got it tailored a little bit and tightened, but I couldn't get it, you know, adjusted way too much because it doesn't have a zip at the back. So you have to, you know, wear it from, um, from your head. So, um... So that's all I have today and don't forget to like, share and subscribe and check out my blog. Info details of everything will be listed down below and I'll talk to you later. Bye! Bisous, à bientôt.